Here are two easy ways to connect your DSLR or mirrorless camera to your computer and use them as a webcam. My name is Nicholas Johnson and this is the Space Warehouse. With either of these methods, you'll be able to use your pro camera just as easily as the built-in webcam on your laptop. It doesn't matter if you're setting up a live stream on OBS or a Zoom call or just a FaceTime. Once you're connected, your computer will just see your camera as a video source and you should be able to select it like a webcam from the drop-down menu. Method one. The first way is the best and most universal way, but it's also the most expensive way. This way will allow you to use the full 4K picture that comes out of your camera, so you can do things like record directly to your computer rather than having to use memory cards. If you're making videos, let's say, like this video that you're watching right now, and you're in the same room as your computer. Unfortunately, this method does cost some money, but I mean, so did your camera, and this cost way less than that. You're gonna need to get your hands on a little device called an Elgato CamLink 4K. It looks like this. It's a little over a hundred bucks, but once you have one of these, it just makes this so simple. You literally just plug one end of this thing directly into your computer with USB 3 or better, and the other end, through an HDMI cable, connects to your camera. And that's it. One thing to remember though, different cameras have different HDMI ports. This is my Nikon D850, it has an HDMI mini port, where my Sony A6600 that I'm filming this video on has an HDMI micro port. Those are two different things. So just make sure that you get the right cord according to your camera. But with this cam link, you don't need any setup, you don't need any additional software. It just somehow tricks your computer into thinking that your HDMI source is a webcam. So you can just plug it in, turn on your camera, open zoom, and it'll just work. Method two, this method only works with Sony mirrorless cameras. And for me on my Mac, it only wants to recognize OBS and zoom. It doesn't see FaceTime or Skype or QuickTime app for some reason. On my Windows PC, it does work. It works pretty flawlessly. All the programs seem to see it. But as long as you already have a Sony camera, you don't have to spend any extra money to make this work. On the downside, the picture quality is a little bit lower resolution than if you're going through HDMI. But on the upside, it does provide power to your camera. So presumably you could just keep it on forever if you have meetings all day or if you're a Twitch streamer or something. Plus on Zoom calls, your picture is usually pretty small anyway. And so the resolution doesn't matter as much and it will still look better than every Every webcam that's ever been made on this planet. Here's how you make it work with Sony cameras. Go and search for Sony Imaging Edge webcam software. Download that, install it, restart your computer, and now when you open Zoom and go to choose your camera, or if you open OBS and you go to make a new video source, you'll have a pull-down menu for Sony Imaging Edge, or maybe it'll just say Imaging Edge. Add a little bit of custom lighting and something like this 30 millimeter 1.4 Sigma lens, and whammo! Your Zoom Square or a little Twitch streaming box looks like a Netflix documentary interview. Hope this helps. Goodbye.